All right. Let me tell you about my family. Justin, I was at Arby's yesterday, and I had my delicious meat meal. Right. I had some of my favorite sandwiches, a selection of my faves. And when I was outside of the Arby's, and by which I mean I behind the Arby's, I took the right. back, back door out. Um, I ran into a woman who was an older woman, I would say, and she was wearing a dark purple robe. And she had sort of a gnarled old face with like some natural fung fungal growth on it. Okay. And she handed me a disc of the video game Dark Souls. And she, oh, and, yeah, and, I'm familiar. And she said, play this in your monster's factory. And I was like, it's just the singular, it's just one monster. Right. She, and she chided me. Um, and it, or She said I had basically, the long and short of this whole story is I went to Arby's and I got my favorite sandwiches. And then a, uh, some sort of witch uh, said I had to play this disc of Dark Souls, this, this game tape, or else I'd be mm. cursed forever. Oh, wow. And I'd be dragged to hell. I love this font, by the way. Is this on brand font? This, I mean, I don't know, man. You'd have to take it up with the Arby's witch. <laughs> um, but let's just hop right into it and uh, do a Monster Factory in Dark Souls because I think we can like have some fun. Well, that's weird. That is so weird. And then, uh, and that theme song. Can we put the theme song up? Because I'm pretty sure it's Snoop Dogg and Dr. Dre's the next episode. Yeah, that is definitely next episode. Um, let's not worry about, like, some of the strange things that we've seen so far, and let's just, like, hop into, uh, let's just hop into character creation, because that's, like, the, the Arby's meat of the Monster Factory brand. Okay. What's on? Sure. What's no, the matter? Well, it just kind of looks like a shoeless pizza on it. It does look like the shield has pizza. I'm sure that's just like how the rust on that shield grew in. Grew, yeah, yeah. He left it under some wet plates. Yeah, he got mold. Yeah, it, that makes sense. It happens. It may, maybe it's just like burnished in that. Maybe like he blocked some fireballs and they just like burned in on the metal of the shield. Okay, great. Okay. Face. That's weird. That's weird. Like if Slim Goodbody was demonstrating that you were all pizza. That's it, that's what it looks like. I mean, it could just also be like a really, really rough condition, like some sort right. of nerve agent, some sort of toxin. I want to point out that I had all these grand plans to do Dark Souls, um, but then I realized that there wasn't a very good ca character editor. I thought this was it. Little did I know that you could further customize it through this menu. And I was dabbling with these things, like there's a random face option, and you know how exciting that is to me. But there still wasn't many options. Little did I know, there's a third sub menu. It, it's it's sub menus all the way down, Dark Souls. Wow. Anyway, let's get wild. We just jam on the one. I don't know that we're getting extreme results, though. Well, I mean, we're getting the thing is. Well, well, hold on. Spoke oh, too soon. Oh, oh, going too far. He's gonna get handsome again. I'm worried what? that I'm worried that different isn't really gonna give us. Let's let's. I know we're no middle sliders, but I think same is not gonna get crazy. Different is not gonna like know how to fuck up the current the current facial yeah. zone enough. All right, so we can now we can just sort of follow the path. You're really hammering on that button, huh? Oh man, it's like I'm playing a fucking sounds Mario like, Party mini game. Sounds like the wizard over there. <laughs> so he's trying to get to California. Oh wow! Oh, we're getting somewhere fun. It looks like the face in the Teletubbies, son. Oh no, that looks like Kabuki theater. <laughs> it's a it's a spooky Kabuki pizza skin, man. Don't like it. I do like it though. Okay, wait, wait, that. That's kind of, that's kind of good. That's kind of good. What's the, I mean, what's the fiction that we're going for, it's though? It's kind of a Crunchberry, isn't he? It's, it's kind like, of... Like, if a Crunchberry came to life? Wow, watching this is, like, the worst. It's, like, the... And the negative Oscar for worst <laughs> short animated film goes to this. All right, don't do any more goof -em ups here. This is really good stuff. This is really good work. Ah, I love that. Look at him. Looks like he's look like he's being permanently pinched by a grandma. Like two grandmas. <laughs> two grandmas just came in and just drew and quartered him. I'm assuming that whatever this Arby's Witch version of Dark Souls is, I haven't, uh -huh. I haven't, you know, obviously I haven't explored it, um, but it seems to have like an emphasis on pizza. Should we just go ahead and make the Noid? 
Oh my goodness. Like a Noid for a modern generation? Like, like a, a modern, modern Noid? Like a modern take on the uh, avoid the Noid. Was that Domino's? Yeah, it was a Domino's hit thing. I kind of like the idea of this this Noid when he comes into your, when he just, well, he, let's call it what it is. He breaks and enters into your house and attacks your family. I don't want him to have like a fun look on his face because in, in many ways I'd find that more upsetting. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, we want a nice relaxing uh, home break in. He just has black, like cold black eyes like a doll's eyes. Okay. This is going to be a scary man that's going to be bad to see. <laughs> yeah. I think some, yeah. Of our, some of our men have been like fun, like haha, uh, like a goof him up. This one will be a bad man to look at and he'll be <laughs> bad to see and take in with the eyes. <laughs> You know what he is like a modern sleek Noid reboot. I'm really liking that. What would would he still be called the Noid or I mean he'd be called something like fucking Noid.com or something. Yeah, Noid dot fart. <laughs> hashtag Noid. <laughs> That's his name, hashtag Noid. We had a we had a the first of probably what will be many system memory issues yeah. while trying to process Arby's Witch Dark Souls. This is just as good of a Noid. Maybe I a better Noid. Yeah, I mean, if, if what do they say about shitty first drafts? This mm. is gonna be this is gonna be a huge improvement. All shitty first drafts belong in the doo doo bin, Ernest Hemingway. That's true. It's on it's, his tombstone. Which is weird that they would let you put the word shitty on a tombstone. Like kids, could, yeah, kids could be having this a cemetery. Kids play in this graveyard, Mister. Wow, I actually like this Noid much better. Thank you. Yeah, I'll take this Noid any day of the week. I, I have pizza upstairs. I wasn't worried about it before. Yeah. But like I am now. I want to go check on my pizza. Huh. Some hmm. challenging stuff. We've never really explored lip play here at the Monster <laughs> Factory. But I want to get really silly with it. Wow, this changes a lot of things. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this devious little scamp. That that almost looks like a mm, pizza. Um, And then we have to pick a class. So obviously I've been thinking about this a lot. Like. The Noid is kind of a thief, right? Except he doesn't take the pizza, he just kind of ruins it. Maybe that makes him more of a bandit. I mean, he's certainly deprived. And yeah. there we get like a, wow, look at that fucking juicy ass. <laughs> he doesn't, there's actually no ass there. Yeah, it's negative ass. The, another ass Noid got his ass. Like right. a Noid that just loves asses. Yeah. I think the class that makes the most sense though is the pizza mancer class because you get uh, okay that's not real you get magic right class. at the beginning of the game and your stats elevate very quickly and it also is just sort of thema them thematically appropriate for the noid this isn't the dark souls that i remember this isn't my grandfather's dark souls no it's it's your grandmother's dark souls if your grandma was a witch that hung out outside of the arby's Okay, now, hold on. Now, up here, up here, up here. What? <laughs> okay, well, I see a few issues just sort of like there. Um, what's the, one? what are, if, can you enumerate the issues and just like, well, can, can you tell me like what's bothering you? <laughs> well, let's start with the UI. Okay. Uh, it looks like it. No, I agree. The Souls games have always had kind of a like the the UI. There's just way better ways to sort of get that information across. Yeah, but like specifically in this one, you know, uh, I think you can see pretty plainly there. Uh, you've got a, in the bottom right a rupees indicator. Oh yeah, and that's then, weird. Yeah, that's actually left. you know what, Justin, you're right. That's not from the original Dark Souls. That is a change. And then I think another change might be uh, the C buttons. On the UI. Oh no, I'm left. playing. I'm playing with a GameCube controller, so that's just it. Just pops those up. All right. Well, that's a pile of pizza. Oh, right well, there. it's the no. This is the. Uh, it's just the bonfire. <laughs> you have to access the bonfires, and they're basically like little checkpoints. Okay. Well. All right. All right. Under the helmet slot, I see four pizzas. Yeah, that is weird, actually. Yeah, with the armor there, just four different pizzas. Um, well, that's what he's, I mean, that is what he's wearing. Like, they do actually a pretty great job of, you Red know, world, world building. That man in the floor has pizza skin. Yeah. Well, yeah, that's, and again, another another unsolved mystery, I guess. There are some, what I'm going to go ahead and call frame rate hiccups that I've been experiencing. <laughs> I can't imagine why. You. Oh, you. Oh. Too slow. 
Is that is that the proper? I don't remember all the dope strats. Okay, 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 okay. All right, yeah. No, I'm starting to think this okay. is maybe an unlicensed pirate version. <laughs> I don't think this is how the game is supposed to look. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> pretty sure the yes, this flask never looked like a Mountain Dew bottle. I'm just gonna rip it and jack it. <laughs> oh no! Fuck yeah! Refreshment, <laughs> power, energy, strength, <laughs> bravery, courage. Insulin. How's your ass? Chopped up? Well, I'll never know. Maybe I'll know in a few seconds. <laughs> hey, yo. Everybody just calm down. Um, wow, this is going pretty rough. I mean, yeah, it does give me some time to like stop. This, is, like, this yeah. is fucking turn based <laughs> Dark Souls. <laughs> it's active time battles here. Uh, I was using the VAT system there. Oh, yeah. Got that big old pilgrim key for me, big pilgrim. Where are those birds? I'm going to feed them some pizza from my mouth. Chew it up, spit it up in them. Give us cold. Give us zest. Give us herbs. Pe Give us peppy. Peppy. Pepperonis. Pepperonis. Well, they're not there. Wait, was this in the original game? Did the Arby's witch hack in like a new, fucking new exclusive area? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> uh, no, did not. Gonna loot. Wow. <laughs> Golly. That's a lot of pizza. That's a great deal. Oh my god, there's a great wow, this whole is the pizza kingdom. It's like a lot of pizza there. Is he returning home or is this a conquest situation? Or did he fall into the dream of a ninja turtle? It's impossible to say. I remember there's secrets back here. Oh my god. Oh, you guys are battling it out, huh? Yeah, we're doing a little trainer battle. I want to see if his Pokemon can stand up <laughs> to my Pokemon. Whoa, whoa, he's coming in. Seal the deal. Done. I want to watch his final breaths up close. Yeah, that's your essence. Mmm, delicious essence. Looks like you should have avoided my ass. <laughs> Is that enough to get another level in? Yeah, I'm gonna name this level Mark <laughs> after the man I killed to get it. <laughs> what should I put Mark into? I mean, Faith would be appropriate, but at the same time, no way. You like to do a good job. Come on, come on, baby. Come on. Are come you talking on, baby. To you or the computer? The computer. <laughs> I do. I am curious what that Steve Harvey item was that we picked up. Yeah. Yeah. Look at him. He's here can to protect you, me. Can you? Now that won't be in, in, uh. Oh my God. <laughs> Having him down there makes me feel like he's like Navi. Like you could just ask him for advice. Whenever. Hey, listen, it's me, Steve Harvey. Hey. Oh, didn't want to use a, okay. Well, yeah, I'll slam a slice. <laughs> <laughs> Seems like a poor time to use it, but whatever. Man, I love these very, very colorful, colorful <laughs> facts, huh? <laughs> Fuck yeah, Harvey strength. Wow, you can really get. Wow, what a high, what a high, high yeah, texture, are, glossy JPEG. I'm to see. <laughs> you can see like the sweat. You can see the 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 grease sweat, the oregano on it. Look at that <laughs> fleck of oregano. Yeah, yeah, I'm starting to see where some of our pizza problems may have come in. This is art. This tunnel has some like pretty cool effects going on though. Yeah, kind of a pizza tube. I would actually love to go down this. This is actually probably what my like intestines look like at this point. Just imagine? like some slow running water through a tunnel of pizza. Oh, 
Undead City might be equal bad. Oh, Maybe it might even, even be more pizza rific. Even be, be, okay. <laughs> This is almost exclusively pizza. Yeah, it looks like the areas that were made out of cobblestone and, you know, the more typical construction materials have been completely substituted here for high glossy pizza JPEGs. <laughs> Which I love. Don't get me wrong. Oh, but, I love uh, looking at pizza. I can look at pizza all day long. It's just I'm worried about the game experience. Like, yeah. Well, now. Your desk is pizza, homie. <laughs> hey, man. Hey, dude, I want to tell you how to do your thing, but your desk is pizza. And you look really wicked hungry, which seems weird to me. Thank you kindly. Thank you kindly. Oh no, what are you doing? <laughs> oh no, not my katana. You broke my pizza desk. How could you do this to me? <laughs> oh, man, I ho you better hope you don't need more arrows. I mean, yeah, I won't, but also I'm not too worried about fucking all bones Ninja Gaiden over here. <laughs> I think I'm gonna be okay. I gotta say the bosses are a whole lot less scary when their names are rendered in Comic Sans. Yeah, that does help. And when they're walking on a bridge made of pizza. If you had an army of hungry kids, then this wouldn't even be a contest. Nice. Wow, that was half his health. This is an easy game made for children. <laughs> We're basically dealing with Mario is missing. <laughs> okay, yeah, easy exactly. first boss. Wow. Jesus. The Noid is like a beast. <laughs> he is unstoppable. I'm glad that the Arby's witch had the good sense to leave some textures. Like, well, yeah, like barrel.exe is still very much a barrel. Yeah. I think she assumed I had like the new top of the line, like Radeon 980. Cause she asked me actually when I was eating my sandwich, I wasn't paying attention cause I was like luxuriating in that beef. But she was like, you've got like that new Radeon 980 shit, right? That's How's the one. You're using a master cooler rig, right? <laughs> that's the one that's got that PPE, right? I'm about to send you on a pizza adventure, but it's going to produce a lot of heat. The uh, pizza processing unit. Side chip. That doesn't seem right. <laughs> that seems inaccurate. It's pretty indicative of Dark Souls that if you made the whole thing out of pizza and put Steve Harvey's face fucking everywhere and switch out the buttons with C buttons and put in Mountain Dew's health potions, it's still better than 99% of all video games. I would say it's better than 100% of the original Dark Souls. Well, that, that game too, yes. All right. Are these slight little... Frame rate whoopsie daisies gonna keep me from crossing the finish line that is made out of fire from a dragon's mouth on this is bridge. No, is there no bonfire over here? Uh, there I'm is. I gotta run to it. I think I gotta get. <laughs> <laughs> the pizza just kind of hides. Ooh, he's not. Oh, oh man. Pure annoyed. Fuck me. Holy Look. shit. Look oh, at yeah. Did they put in, did the Arby's Witch put in some sort of like sexy mod? Yeah. To you make know, they, go, they got those for Skyrim. I think maybe one of those exists for this game as well. He looks like the Lord. Like the pizza makes a lot more sense when A, as near as I can tell, his loin cloth is also made of pizza. Let me see. Okay, yeah. Cool. That, that does seem to be another pizza based promotional item. It's a living. <laughs> That's a fun little thing I like to do. Love doing that. Is the fire pizza? Fire it looked... ball pizza. It looked vaguely pizza-like. Let's see. It, I think it may be. I think it might just be a no. I think it might just be a million pizzas. That's pizza, dog. Yeah, that's a million pizzas. <laughs> Oops. Oops. You're gone. You're out. Thanks for the souls, thug. Did you want to fuck around too, or? Oh man, looks like everybody's getting pushed off a bridge today. <laughs> that was just one of those days, huh? God. <laughs> what the fuck? Well, that's not, I mean, this isn't, this seems. All right, whatever. All right, fuck the Drake sword. Can't, I hate to ask it, but can you just like put in a hack to make your arrows like do a million damage? I mean, I could download a Megan Trainer right now if you want me to. <laughs> Is that the kind of video you want to make? I mean, we could get really... No, we could get really fucking far in the game really fast. No, come on. Let's... No, here. No, that's a good idea. Let's cheat. Capture. Show the fucking weakness. If we're going to fucking cheat, let's do it right. How to give up on Dark Souls. 
Why do most people quit? Because their brothers <laughs> tell them to. <laughs> you weren't even aiming. Dark like, Souls Megan <laughs> Trainer. <laughs> Unlimited Souls, does that sound good, Justin? I'm gonna download this, so I'll probably get my computer even more viruses than Dark Souls Arby's Witch Edition has already put on here. But let's go crazy. <laughs> There's no way your computer will be able to sustain the sort of like rending. Hey, do you think? Hey, do you think this is the real download button or not? <laughs> Whoa, I've got a lot of souls. Wow. What kind of build should we go for? Because uh, <laughs> I was thinking like Galactus of the consumer <laughs> of worlds. Yeah, unkillable. Yeah, for sure. Come on, yeah. motherfucker. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, once you do it, it does yeah, the damage. I mean, thing. get it out. It does it. Oh, sweet. I mean, it goes against my whole aesthetic, but. Uh, no, it doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> Their faces look so weird. Yeah, I can't figure it out. I mean, the 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 Arby's wish did warn me that she'd replace the faces of all the undead monsters with a, a high res glossy P and G of Louis Anderson. Oh, is but that, that might problem? be hard to. I can't prove or deny it. Yeah. Man, what if the walls are covered in Louis Anderson and their faces were pizza? That's probably an easy fix, I think, J Man. <laughs> in fact, <laughs> why don't we do a save and quit right here and see if we can't reach le World Two One together? <laughs> yeah. The, no, the Arby's which said it's a glitch in the game. If you replay, if you, holy shit, I have infinite items. Um, if you throw down an alluring skull in the, exactly the right, oh, I'm doing a bit. <laughs> if you throw down an alluring skull in just the right area, then it does a texture swap now. signs <laughs> for him and pizza is pretty great pizza <laughs> i'm louie anderson and this is my running mate pizza <laughs> we're taking over all of dark Souls. oh my god well i certainly haven't lightened the the loading load on this game hey, thanks for loading such a glossy jpeg of me <laughs> got a high res texture <laughs> hey <this> <laughs> That's pretty much the worst, huh? <laughs> hey, sorry about all that. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <laughs> thanks, pal. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, that's me, Louie. Can you slide the pieces? I'm, I'm like the back of a fucking Shoney's menu here. <laughs> Rearrange the pieces, kids. It's fun. You'll get a free 2% milk if you figure it all out. <laughs> the upside down Louis are fucking cracking it. <laughs> hey, it's me, Louis. I know you're about to fight a hard boss, so here's a cheat code. <laughs> I think this version of Dark Souls is sick. <laughs> oh no! Hey, do battle on me! <laughs> Brave Knight? Don't spill any blood in my mouth. Just kidding. Do. I'm nasty. I've been nasty this whole time. <laughs> I can't believe I got an achievement for that. I can't believe the game is rewarding me with achievements. <laughs> I'd, I'd like to make a run for a boss because I'll tell you what I think would be great. What's that? Is if you could capture video of us <laughs> beating a boss and then upload it as uh, like a hints video yeah, for beating that boss, but make no reference to the fact <laughs> that the walls are pizza and your shield is Steve Harvey and Louis Anderson is there too. Yeah. And, so and that you have infinite health and every strike is um, a death blow. All right. Well, let's next time we get to a boss, remind me and we'll just like do a live VO sesh on that. Yeah. Oh man. Oh, that's a lot of boys. I don't think they're gonna let me hit him. 
No, I don't think they're gonna let this happen. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> what? No! What the fuck? Infinite health! <laughs> you dullard. Infinite health used to mean something in my day. When I plugged in a game genie and I tapped in all the numbers and letters and it said, don't worry, Griffin, you're not going to die. That was a bond of trust. <laughs> game genies let us down again. Well, I was playing Bart's Nightmare and I turned on infinite lives. If I ran out of lives, I would go back to EB Games or Babbage's and I would return the game genie. Excuse me, Toys R Us. Can I speak to your manager? I've got a faulty genie on my hands. <laughs> I need people to once the the monster factory faq gameplay walkthrough of the capra demon <laughs> blood loss even blood loss is funny <laughs> it's just marinara when uh faq walkthrough goes up i need everybody to like and share it with their friends but uh tell them it's a really great strategy and that everybody should really get on it and that it's changed the way you see dark souls forever holy shit you just got wait what, what is he Okay, he had like an extra boy on him. Oh my god, these men are just monkeying around. <laughs> Stop being so silly, boys. They're using my body like a McDonald play place. Oh, now they're not. Yeah, now they're. Now like, they're... I know we're cheating a lot in this Louis Anderson pizza fantasy world, but it's still really satisfying to kill dudes in Dark Souls. Yeah. Uh, traverse this white light. All right, this here we go. All right, so this is going to be a quick walkthrough on how to take down the Capra Demon. You might get hit by the wolf and the Capra Demon and the other wolf uh, right when you start out the fight. Don't even worry about that. You want to get up these pizza stairs as quick as you possibly can um, and then roll off them. And then that's going to confuse the Capra Demon. It's all about demon confusion is the trick to this fight. Justin, you got any pro strategies you want to share? Yeah, if he leaves you in an opening, you definitely want to take advantage of it. Uh, watch his animations for any time it looks like he wants to be stabbed or you could stab him and he'd love it. Um, it's it's really important to have uh, 9,999,999 souls before going into this fight. Uh, yeah. The Capra Demon's going to see that number, and he's going to be, like, just kind of confused by it the whole time. Now, the trick is, in your first hit, take away over half of his health bar. You may be wondering how to do that. You might say, Griffin, my DPS isn't high enough for the Capra Demon fight. Um, and I say, like, I understand that. It's time to hit, go back to the, the old time Iron Church. Time Nobody to grind. Nobody wants to grind, and, but, but it's important to take at least half his health with every sword swing. And uh, do not take damage. If you take damage, make sure it instantly refills. Now, you want to try and get the camera inside of your character. And this is going to be really important because if you can't see the Capra Demon, he can't see you. Now, your pizza slices may not be representative of humanity. Your humanity may not look like pizza slices. In that case, you're going to want to make sure you have the latest patches downloaded. Those are updated really regularly. And they, they really change the balance of the game, Justin. That's right. And a lot of the tips we're giving you just aren't going to be uh, functional in versions 1.7 through 1.9. Yeah, if, you're, if, you're, if you have any differences other than what we're showing you, uh, you have a patch that hasn't downloaded. And you definitely want to get in touch with Namco Bandai and let them know that you have a technical snafu on your hands um now what you want to do is get your gold pine resin ready you want to have 35 of them and face <laughs> this wall and then just shake your head no 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 i can't shake it no now you may see that and wonder like does that mean i can't use the item does this mean i can't use the item i'm worried about how many times the wolf is hitting me and that's totally fine um, that's completely normal uh this is a great strategy uh <laughs> Now, it is really going to help to slam a do here if you uh, do need any extra health. And uh, make sure that you do have the Steve Harvey shield uh, before you enter this area. You're going to find that in the upper lower undead bird. Oh, uh, make sure you stop by there. And again, don't worry about all the hits that you're taking. <laughs> you're, you're not going to lose any health. Try to think about the hits that you're not taking. Anyway, you want to stand pretty close to a Louis Anderson symbol of power. Make sure you no-scope him, too. Yeah. It's and really then, important. And then you've got the key to the depths, no problem. And uh, remind me again, Justin, where I take that key to the depths. Just to the depths? <laughs> yeah, that's, sure. Uh, anyway, that's it. That's, for the, whole our, video, that's the whole end of the video for our Dark Souls strategy guide. Stay tuned. Uh, we were having some trouble with the rest of the bosses, but I think with enough persistence, we're going to be able to crack this nut. Thanks for watching IGN. <laughs> Thanks for watching IGN. We're IGN, and this is IGN. If the Noid is tasked with trampling pizzas. Yeah. He has done He's literally doing it. Job. Yeah, he's doing it. I mean, right he does now. it all the time. He hits pizzas with swords. He sets them on fire. He transposes pictures of Louis Anderson onto them. Well, he didn't he, he didn't do that. The Arby's witch did. 
Well, oh. that's... Oh. No, oh. That, no, that happens from time to time. The old Noid doesn't exist anymore. This Noid does. Yeah. Uh, and he destroys pizza, like, with a lot of efficacy. And he's using a medium that's going to connect with teens and kids. And that's video games, not TV anymore. No, ch no child's ever seen a TV. Yeah, this, I mean, if anything, this game has made me, I guess, hate pizza. Does the Noid hate pizza? No, he just likes, he prefers calzones. I guess that makes sense. Yeah. Um, how would you review this really uh, fascinating art game version of Dark Souls that we're playing? Um, well, I have a pretty specific scale of uh, uh, Family Feud hosts. <laughs> okay. um, Ray Combs kind of being at the bottom. He did his best, but just not like my fave. Yeah. And then number one is Steve Harvey. And on this I'm scale. I'm so glad to hear you say that. Yeah, of course. It's, it's, it's like he was born to do it. Um, but on that scale, I'm going to rate this uh, game, and this is mainly just to get an image of him in, in the video. Uh, I'm going to rate him a Richard Carn. Yeah. Oh my goodness! What is that? <laughs> what is that even? 